Okay, in this TTS video, I'm going to show you exactly how I select my place selections every day using TTS. I'll just move that along there a little bit. Um, I'm going to show you how I use three different um, columns to find three different types of selections every day. And these are the ones that I place in the Facebook group and on the Discord server. So stay tuned and let me show you how I do it. Okay, so generally there are three types of tips I select every day, but they're all for the place market, although many of them do win. So there could be arguments there as well. Um, but what we're going to do is first we're going to look at the tip and that's the, the, the number of tipsters tipping that horse every day based on our database information. So if I select the column header, it sorts by that. So you can see you've got 11, 1, 0, 0, 0. So this is obviously the top tipped runner this um, in this race today. But what I want to know is who's the top tipped of the day. So if we go over to this um, link here and go sort by day, we now have the selection sorted by from the top of the day all the way down. So there are actually two that are selected today um, that have got 11 tipsters. Now, sometimes there's only one and I just select the first one. Um, if there's two like this, then I have to make a decision about which one I'm going to select. Um, now, there's a couple of ways that I could do that. Generally, I look at their last, their form. So this has come second, 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 first. So that's pretty good. This has come first and been pulled and then second, six and two. So out of the two of them, I would say that's got a little bit more consistent as far as place is concerned. Um, this selection has got green rating. This one hasn't, but there's not a lot in it. Um, the other thing is that this has got a higher MRS rating. So I think out of the two of them, Hurdle Novice, although that's a Hunter National Hunt flat. So I don't know about that. Um, so I think what I'm going to do is I am actually going to go for this one. Now, there is a slight risk with this one because of that. And the MRS is not particularly high. But out of those two and the tips, I'm going to go on this one. I often end up going for the first selected of the day. So that you know, in this case, I, I've gone for that one. So what I do is I just stick that on a notepad um, so that I, I know. So 1342 um, and it is um, Fosswa, Fos, F Floss, whatever. <laughs> I do know. I do know. I do. I really do somewhere. Um, <laughs> we put that down and I'm going to start that um, as the top tip of the day so i always do that just so um people in the fb group and on the discord server will know that okay so the next one i'm going to go for is the top mrs of the day now this one i do slightly different so we we'll just click that there so the mrs is my own rating that is based on past performance and bits and pieces about the race and everything else so not always just about the runner but there's lots of bits of information in there so the top one is 25 now I like my MRS selection to have at least three greens and really first last time out. So that wouldn't be a selection because of two of those points. That wouldn't be a selection for two of those points. This one's close with two greens. Now, if I go too far down, I may select that one, but we're going to come down here. We've got an MRS of 19, but we've only got um, form of one on the last one. So as you can see, we're going down and down and down. I don't really like the form too much on that one. So I could either select that one um, with an MRS 19, or I could select one of the other ones, maybe this one, because it's so close to it. And I think I'm going to go for, yeah, this one here, the 1522 uh, at Pontefract. Um, Perseverance, perseverance. Um, so I'm going to go for that one today. So we're going to go 15, 22, Pontefract, Pont, and we're going to go that. So that's our second one. Now the third one I do on the back to in play um, score, which is this score here, which if 
there will be a link where you can get these selections free every day for the back to in play selections but they also the score also appears in the um, TTS ratings so if I now go by there what I'm looking for is above five so we've got a few here and um, again I kind of look at the form I quite again so perseverance comes up again perseverance I think that's right um with two two greens so I don't really like to have the same selection so I'm, I'm going to go down a bit and have a look at that fell last time out this one's quite interesting um one free I don't like the form on that one so we've still got five here so I think it's between these two so MRS of 16, MRS of 14, tipster, tipster. I just don't, I don't like seeing too many, you know, falls in, in, a, in the form. I think I'm going to go on this one. So I think I'm going to go for, out of those, yeah, I'm going to go for Trilby. So that would be my last selection. That's, that's as late in the day as I like to go on selections as well. I don't really like doing evening races on these myself personally. Um, I generally finish work by about 5.30, so I don't want to go over that. So I will put that down and get rid of the gelding part. And that's how I select my three for the day. Now, obviously, you could go a bit deeper into each one, and if you're not too happy, you can go further down. And also, you can use other columns to um, verify or clarify particular runners um, to see if that you know, you like them more because of one thing or another. All of these columns that are in blue are... Um, are sortable so you could look at lots of different information about them some people like um, one third so they might look at that the average um, information or AVG information is always top of a lot of people's lists so there's lots of ways you can actually look at it but this is the way I do it to find those three so those are my three today which if you're watching this in the future is not going to be a lot of good but it's the 22nd of the 4th today people say you should never use a date in your video but anyway that's how I selected today's selections and I will now go and place them in the FB group and in on the Discord server so um, the members can have a look at them. Okay, I hope you found that useful. If you're watching on YouTube, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and let me know whether you've got any comments. And that'd be great and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.